let's look at question 2.2.3. This is update deductions. The deductions amount for a specific payment. So here you can see we are dealing with payments. So we are referring to the payment table was captured incorrectly. The user must select a record from the grid. So that's our grid name. The user will select a record. Write code to update the deductions field of the record that has been selected by increasing, increasing the deductions amount by 1%. So if we select a particular record, that particular record that was selected must be increased, the deductions must be increased by 1%. <laughs> so how would we go about doing something like that? So we first need to go into edit mode. So we're gonna say TBL payments because that's the table we are working with. TBL payments dot edit. We are now in edit mode. And now we can start making the change. So we're gonna say TBL payments. And the field we're looking at is the deductions. That's the deductions field. And that needs to take on the value of its original. And we need to find 1% and add it to the original. So it's serving as an accumulator. So it's gonna be TBL payments deductions plus we're gonna go TBL payments deductions times 1% is 0 0.01. So this will work out 1% of the deductions. It, de it then takes that answer and adds it to the original amount. So it's increasing the original amount by 1% and that final answer is then being stored back into the TBL payments deduction field and the original value is then lost. Once that is finished, we then need to save this. So we need to say TBL payments dot post to save the new answer that we calculated. There could have been a shorter way in which you did this. Uh, you could have said TBL you could have said TBL deductions, colon equals TBL payments deductions times 1.01. .01. So you could have had a calculation that was something similar to this. TBL payments deductions times one. 0.01. And obviously, this would have been stored in TBL payments deductions. What this is now doing all in one line, the 1.01, .01, the one when you multiply anything by one, you get back the same value. And that's what this part it's doing, it's getting back, the, it's taking the original value. And then the 0.01 is the second part where it's working out the 1%. So this multiplies by one, which is the original, and the 0.01 adds the 1% to the original, giving you a final answer, which is then stored in TBL deductions, in TBL payments in the deduction field. 